Hey, it's John here. Uh, all right, today we're going to be doing um, checking the piston pin length on a 2 4 band. Um, this is a 4L6E transmission, uh, GM transmission. Now, each one's going to be a little different just depending on what you're working on. Uh, basically, what you got to do is you got to have your tool here. It's going to go in where your servo is. Slide that in there. You're going to take the locker ring that actually works for the servo. Slide it in there. Get it good and locked in. Okay. So now, specifications on this call for 98 inch pounds. So what you do is you take your inch pound torque wrench, put it on here. I'm just gonna pull. We can see a little line inside the hole. We're just barely in there, but should be pretty good. Um, now, so we're we're pretty close to the right length on the piston pin. If when you go to torque it and it torques down and clicks, you don't see the line, then your piston pin is too long. And what's that's what that's gonna do is that's gonna basically engage your two four band all the time which is gonna burn it up. And then eventually you're not gonna have any you know, second fourth isn't gonna work properly. If the uh, piston pin is too short, then it's not gonna engage enough and it's gonna cause slipping in second and fourth gear. Uh, hope this has been helpful. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.